welcome back to another video guys so today what i'll be doing is i'll be ranking every proposed jamaican flag now if you don't know what this is basically leading up to independence jamaica held a flag design competition and these flags that you see on the screen are basically some of the designs that were submitted in the competition and what i'll be doing i'll be taking these flags and i'll basically just be ranking them from worst to best now i want to get the negativity out of the way from now and just deal with the worst and it will have to be this one like this is likely an american crocodile on the middle of the flag and we don't really want an american crocodile on our flag so we're going to get rid of this right now and this one so basically this is basically an exact replica <laughs> like an exact replica in terms of colors and design of the flag of Tangakia and because of that this instantly get disqualified now Tangakia is no longer a country but even then back in back at back when this was being designed um it was a country and this was their flag so just for the lack of research I have to put this one in the worst tier now let's move on to the rest of them all right so this one is pretty average this is a very average design we see this design often even though we have the coat of arms in the middle this one has to be in the average tier to be honest with you this is also a very a very very average design but um maybe if i knew what the stars meant maybe um i could put it a little higher but as of now, I don't know. I'll try to count them. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. 14. Hmm. <laughs> oh, so it is 14 stars. Uh, maybe, maybe that is the 14 parishes. So, if this is actually represented the 14 parishes, this is actually a little bit creative and i'll definitely put this right here and this seems like it is also 14 stars yep so okay so i was going to put these in the average tier but seeing that the stars seem like it represents the 14 parishes of jamaica then i'll boost them a tier higher honestly that's a bit creative um i don't think that I mean, the United States have the states as their stars and their flags, so they also did something like that. Um, maybe that's where the inspiration came from, but I like this design now, now that I think of it, and I appreciate this design. This one would go in average. I mean, this is a very average design for a flag. Uh, there's not much creativity there, but the colors, the colors are unique i'll give it that so maybe i'll put it in the good for the colors the colors are unique no other country currently have just these colors so the colors are unique this one no this ain't average this is a good flag this is a good flag i like the design on this one this one is it's a bit unique in the design i like this one this is a good flag and this i would put hmm i think this is the one that i would rank the best and so yeah this is basically how i would rank each of the designs that were submitted in the competition so this one is the one that if it was up to me this is the one i would choose however there's currently a huge issue with this flag so with our flag that we have now the jamaican flag our flag is the only flag in the world that does not have the colors red white or blue now if we take a look at this flag we can see that this flag literally has all of these colors red white and blue meaning if we were to go with this flag then we would not have the uniqueness that we have now with our flag uh so what i did was i took this design and i basically changed it up a little i basically you know add our colors to it and i'm going to be honest with you i am not a fan of either of them um they, they just don't look good this one I, I don't like the fact that i had to put white in it this one is not appealing at all this one is even worse 
Uh, this one is, is my favorite out of all of them. Like, I'm not a fan of either of them, but if I was forced to choose one, this is the one that I would choose. But all in all, what I'm realizing is that really and truly, our flag just come out on top. Like, I am really, really happy that this is currently on the official flag of Jamaica. Because, and it could be my bias, to be honest with you, but... I'm just not really a big fan of the others. I really appreciated the fact that these had the stars, which likely means, um, which likely represents the 14 parishes. I'm, I'm assuming at least, but if that is the case, I actually really appreciate that design. But truly, this one come out on top. Anyways, guys, that's the end of this video. Don't forget to subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers by the end of this month. So I'd really appreciate it if you could subscribe to the channel. Also, like it. If you enjoyed it, you can share it as well. And I'll see you in the next one.